the Joe Rogan experience. We could never get a normal job. So my only paid job I ever did was, yeah, medical trials, checking into hospitals and testing out drugs that weren't on the market yet. Whoa. Yeah. You did that? Yeah, I did that for two years. What did they test out on you? I, I stopped listening. You know, I, I was like, you just whatever. let him try it. Yeah, yeah. They, they would tell me that like, oh, Jeez. this could happen or this could happen, and I was like, I, just give me whatever. I don't give a fuck. Just give me some money. Daniel would have crazy like side effects. I, I, like yeah. it was like yellow once. Yeah, it's like yellow you're, now. Yeah, yeah. Well, I, it was but like, like he was like he was like once he was like we are, well we have ADHD we have always shaking. But Danny was like once he was like this like. I went to visit him. He was doing like shaking, and I was like, "Your eyes, like, yeah, it's just side effect of the drug." Uh, anyway, we're, we're, it was it was like a uh, muscle tremors all up through my arm, so I just couldn't physically. Yeah, I just. Couldn't, what was yeah. that drug? I I literally, <laughs> dude, I did not listen to. Her. They would tell me they would send all these big pamphlets, and we'd have to sign a bunch of shit. But I would never listen. I would never know what I was there for. I would never. Did do you this, have any concern about doing that? No, I was more excited to get How some cash. How old were you at the time? Eighteen. Yeah, that's the problem. Yeah, yeah. You shouldn't let 18-year-olds make that decision. <laughs> yeah, I, 18 to 20 is when I did it. Well, yeah. it was a way for you to, like, make money I as well and meet, like, people. Because there's a lot of interesting people that would go through there. But I, sure. I just hate injections, so I don't know. I, yeah, I also shit. did it to try and get over my fear for injection. Because once they, take, like, administer the drug, they have to, like, get your blood every 15 minutes. So, like, they'd put the cannulas in their arm, in your arm, and they just keep taking out blood, taking out blood, and just testing whether or not things would go wrong. What uh, was the worst side effect you got? Yeah. He grew a third eye. Oh, fuck off, no, I didn't. I, was, I, I, um, I remember they were, it was, they were administering it with like a cannula. It was, it was a drip. They were dripping the, injection, uh, the, the drug in and it was really fucking hurting. And usually it doesn't hurt. Usually I just like uh, take it or you know, they would administer it. I didn't really feel anything, but it was painful. And it was hurting, it was hurting. I was like, oh God. She's like, are you all right? I'm like, yeah, yeah, it's okay. It's okay, you can keep, yeah. And I was like, oh fuck, that really drills. It was like, felt like someone was punching my arm. Did they miss the vein? No, the no. Tissue? It, it was like, whatever had happened was my whole arm went paralyzed. And I was like, dude, I, I'm like, I can't, I can't, I can't move. I can't feel my hand. I can't move my hand. She's like, all right, well, just squeeze my finger. She put her finger there to try and squeeze it. And I'm like, oh, I, I literally can't do it. So she said that, they're like, all right, quickly take the drug out. And they took the drug out. And I was just sort of sitting there with a paralyzed arm. And it probably sat there for like an hour. And once the drug had worn off, I, I got my... My feeling and back. you don't remember what that drug was? Fuck, I'm so sorry. I really, I could dig it up my emails probably, but yeah. I, how how that, many different drugs did they try on you? I, well, I did it for two, two, three years, so over ten drugs, I'd say, different things I tried. It was like you go on there for like, like group, like sometimes of like months. four. See, I was doing the work experience on set, but I, I was mine was free, so Danny would do the stuff that got the money. Yeah, or that. <laughs> I, I think that whatever I, that was. The longest time I was in hospital for it could range from three days in hospital to two months. So, oh yeah, one time I was in there for two months. And for what? For the drugs. So, so the you drugs. just stayed in the hospital for two months while they administered drugs? Yeah, yeah. And then they pretty much just uh, wait to see what the side effects are going to be. If they think and it you could have be... to sleep in the hospital and stay there? Yeah, you just stay there overnight. How much do they pay you for something like that? 150 bucks a day, 120 bucks a day. between Australian, 100... so, so what is 100 that? US or something like that. Less than that, yeah, $90 USD a day. For months? Yeah, one to two months. But yeah, <laughs> is that, is that, that, wait, 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 wait. No, it is crazy. Like there was that famous case. I don't know if it was in where it was, but the the patients because they do it like in a row. They'll test one person, then half an hour later, test another, then another, right? And then people started dying off, and like they knew it was like <laughs> going down the line because like someone died half an hour later. They died. That was like a freak. Imagine being the last guy, and they go and they go, look, look. Yeah, you're about to fucking die. Yeah, look. No, the, there's this side effect. That you're how many next. people died? Well, I, okay, I, don't know, I don't know what story specifically this guy's talking about, but the trials that I was checking into, no one died. The worst one I heard of was they test it on mice before they test it on the humans. And they had to bring everyone back into the trial and say, hey, guys. And I heard this from a friend that recommended the trials to me. He's like, guys, we don't want anyone to worry, but um, some of the mice have gone blind. And yeah, so everyone was sort of waiting to see if someone was going to fuck up their site. But and everyone this was, was after you'd already gotten the drug? Yeah, well, no, it was a friend. This is a friend's experience. Yeah, they'd had the drug and they brought everyone back in like a week later and they said some of the mice have gone blind. Jesus. Yeah, yeah. But, you know, what, what, what was the best part is when. <laughs> <laughs> the best part was when. Oh, it the does blindness get, was the best part. No, no, the best part is when the drug goes wrong and then you get to leave early because you'd have to stay for the two months. Like, right, this drug's too dangerous. We're not going to test it. And then you get paid for the full amount. Wait, 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 wait. That yeah. makes no sense. The it drug does. goes wrong. Yeah. So like that one when they administered it and my whole arm went paralyzed, they realized they couldn't administer that drug to everyone else. So the trial got called off, but you got paid for the full month. No long-term side effects? No. Oh, look at him. <laughs> I don't know. 
I've never really questioned it until you're looking at me like I'm I'm crazy. Come on, man. What's what's it's just the drug. Well, trial. if you pay attention to drug trials and like yeah. how many drugs get approved and then pulled because they find I mean that's just after approval. Yeah. And you're way before approval. Yeah, yeah. You're guinea pig. I was yeah, I was a guinea pig. He was the so guinea pig crazy. after the guinea pigs. Yeah. Uh, well, yeah, it was it was a yeah. Mom, that, that, it's a little Isn't... bit of a safety net to be like, oh, it's tried on hamsters before. Yeah. Mm. Mm. But yeah, it was it was pretty dodgy. But it was the only way that I could make money. 